Android 14 ROMs are officially out. And with that said, we also need a TWRP which will help us to flash this ROM efficiently on our device. So this is the TWRP build exclusively made to flash Android 14 ROMs. So without any further ado, let's get into it. So as always, we need some files to flash this TWRP. For that, just go to this telegram channel. All the links are given down in the description. So navigating to this channel, you will see this notification of the TWRP recovery. So this recovery is something which is made exclusively to flash the Android 14 ROMs. Though it's unofficial, but it's all safe because it will help us to flash the 14 ROMs. This is also something as a fixture for the encryption decryption which happens in the Android ROMs and this recovery is built to escape that thing. Moving to the link, you will see that this is the download section over where the very first file is something which you have to download. So this is the very first link, you simply have to click on it and there will be a 10 second timer which will redirect you to the download link. So in our case, I have already downloaded this TWRP, so there is no need to download. So over here, you just have to click on it and it will be downloaded. Once it's downloaded, you just have to move to the file explorer and you will see this is the file which is the .image file. Now simply you just have to reboot to the TWRP of your phone and let's jump into it. So here this is the TWRP which we have already installed on our phone and we installed a whole lot of Android 13 and Android 12 ROMs using this TWRP. So this is the current version and now it's time to upgrade. So after this you just have to click on the wipe option. Clicking on it just go to advance and wipe Dalvik and art cache. Once you do this you just have to swipe to wipe. Over here this is wipe as a mandatory step and now you just have to go back and click on install. After installing this you will see that there are a whole lot of zip files but not the .image file. So this is the folder where we have kept that TWRP file but you won't be able to see that. For this you have to toggle between the install image and install zip file. So simply click on this button and now you will be able to see the .image files. So for this after clicking on it you just have to click on the .image and here you go where they will ask you where you want to install this image. These are the partitions but you know that we have to install this on the partition of recovery. So just simply click on recovery and you are good to go. Once you select that, just swipe and your TWRP recovery will be flashed on the recovery partition which is actually needed. So within few seconds, our flashing process has been done. Now you will have to click on reboot and click on the recovery. Once you click on reboot, your phone will be rebooted to the recovery again and now you will be having the updated version of the TWRP which we are intended to flash. So over here, you just have to click on swipe to allow modification as the setup step and boom, you are all set with the option which you actually need to flash Android 14 ROM with the latest TWRP installed. At first look, you will be able to see everything is almost same. Nothing is something which is added exclusively or excluded. Everything is same as it is. But the only difference is probably you don't have to flash the DFE while installing Android 14 ROM and you are good to go without using that DFE zip because they have fixed the encryption and decryption. So that's it for this video guys if you like this video must hit that like button and also subscribe this channel for more such updates upcoming. Until then see you guys again in the next one. Until then peace out.